teacher at Northwestern Public Schools. Um, I have a statement prepared, which I'm going to throw out the window based on tonight's comments. Um, first off, I totally support Alana Reed. Um, being on the school board, I supported her when she ran for city council, and I support what she stands for in terms of racial equity. I also support the board for appointing her onto the, onto the board. What I don't support is how you as a board are allowing the abuse that's happening tonight to Ms. Reed. And I'll talk more about that in a moment. I'd like to remind you after the Capitol High hate speech incident this spring, Superintendent Murphy stated, Incidents like these do harm to our entire community. However, the brunt of the blow can be especially felt by our community members who are black. It is also my primary responsibility to ensure that we relentlessly pursue the creation of an anti-racist Olympia School District, where awareness, compassion, and celebration of our diversity is of the greatest importance. It is in such an environment where racist ideas and acts could have no fertile ground to grow. Now, we've had a lot of things flown, thrown around tonight about being a veteran, as if that is a disclaimer for um, not being racist. I'm a veteran of the U.S. Army. I'm an Army, I'm a Navy brat. And if we look at number four, have the skills, knowledge, and courage to identify and confront personal, systemic, and racist and societal bias. Just the fact that you're a veteran doesn't mean that well, you're not racist or that I'm getting off topic. I'm sorry, I should have stuck my notes. Um, looking at what I'm trying to say is systemic racism is real. It's in the army, it's in the military, it's in the educational system, it's in this room. And you as a board are engaging in equity work where you're identifying systemic racism that is happening. I'm going to ask that you identify the systemic racism that is keeping people from fully embracing Alana Reed and make a statement against that systemic racism. You as a board have not come out and said, we stand by our decision for Ms. Reed. We made a decision based on these principles, and we are supporting her. We cannot allow the white supremacy that is being discussed in this room. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't do it justice. I apologize. I support you. That's why I'm here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, thank you. I have to be. 